In this video, we will learn about a new feature, namely, Elementor Generator. Let's just practice. First let's activate our project. And on WordPress, the Elementor plugin is activated. The plugin that we created is activated as well. Let's go to the Elementor editor. After that back to the project, we select third-party APIs menu and click Elementor widget. Then we click the Add New Elementor widget button. We fill in the required fields. Name field is filled with name, for example list stories. Label field is filled with list stories. We choose the appropriate icon. Category, we choose the basic category. Generator type, select auto and custom code select on. and we click the Save Changes button. Click Edit. And we go back to WordPress, and refresh the Elementor Editor page. Our widget is here. Now, we are going to add widget options. For widget options, tabs must start with the Start section. For example, Tab 1. Options such as Color. Then we save, and we see the result. If we want to add more tabs, then it must be closed first with Type N section. Then start again with the Start section type, for example Tab 2. We add more widget options for example, size, type number, then we save. So, the structure is 
Start Section Option Ends with End Section Repeats again with Start Section Another Option For the last one it doesn't need to be closed because it's automatic For more details, please see this guide. For two tabs, start section, end section, start sec section while for the three tabs, start section, end section, start section, end section, start section. Then we save. Let's see the result. Tab 1, Tab 2. We change the label to make it more clear. Tab 2, Tab 1 How to add output or content For example, we need a list of pages, we select WP page, we write the name, label, then we save and we see the result. The result will appear automatically like this. How to use custom code To use custom code, it is enough to change the generator type to custom code and turn off copy to custom code. Then click Save Changes. After that you can modify the code as you wish. Thank you.